Just hours ago, more than 10,000 people lined the streets of downtown Tequila for one of the largest Memorial Day parades in all of Georgia. Yeah, and it takes hundreds of volunteers to carry photographs of fallen soldiers from Georgia. But last week, organizers feared they wouldn't have enough people to walk. 11 Alive's Brittany Kleinpeter shows us how the community came together. Despite worries that they wouldn't have enough volunteers to hold all of the signs today for about 10 minutes, all you could see was a crowd honoring fallen heroes. It's truly an honor for us to carry carry these marks of, of so many soldiers that have uh, given their lives, sacrificed their lives for the freedoms and the liberties that we have here in our country. It was just so moving and it still it breaks me up, but they gave it all and we're just here to enjoy it. While holding back tears. Touching, very touching. They marched together through downtown Tequila on a mission. There was 337 signs today. Last year, 324, and it continues to grow. All with a different reason for walking. And I would never want to be one of those parents that came in and got the news. So that's why I do it. But all with a shared belief. It would be an honor for anybody in my book to carry one of those signs because it's somebody who gave them the freedom that they've got to walk in the parade. Organizers weren't so sure they'd see this site. Ladies and gentlemen, the fallen heroes of Georgia. The reason we're here today. With just days to go before the parade, the fallen heroes of Georgia, along with Southern Crescent Veteran Services, put out a call for help. Within hours, enough volunteers had answered willing to walk for others. We're all soldiers to a certain degree, and, and so we kind of felt that uh, sense of pride and, and encouragement. Organizers say there were more than 1,000 participants that walked in the parade, including the 337 people who marched with a sign. Reporting in Decula, Brittany Kleinpeter, 11 Alive News.